Righteous protection. What is going on, fam? Death Jam Friday. The weekend is here, another week. Party time. Oh, it's party time. So, this week we got Master P. You saw the beef, you saw him <clears throat> and Ice T, and you saw him get the victory. So, next episode of uh, Universe Mode, he's gonna get his title shot. You saw that new belt too? Ooh, wee, the thing. Blah. So, Master P move said is, is kind of a powerful, not like 50 Cent athletic powerful, but just got some good moves in it. I like it. Master P is. is one of my more favorite people. I mean, of course, this goes back to mid '90s when I was in school. Like, no limit, especially down here, rule the world. You know, we we was all about no limit. He had a homeboy. <laughs> that boy got a no limit tank tatted on his back. I ain't go that far. Don't get me wrong. I love Master P, and we rep no limit. But I wasn't finna do all that. Man, there was what? About 465 No Limit Soldiers and everybody had a record? Man, that, I mean, but, you know, that's the type of dude P was. He put everybody on. And tried to look out for everybody and help everybody. Now, in present day, if you see him and what he's doing with the groceries and... That's my guy. That dude is actually trying to help and trying to do something productive with his money, with his time, with his name, you know what I mean? So... Shouts out to P, especially, I know a lot of people really kind of got turned on to him some months ago with his little episode on the BET show, in which all of that to me was not new, you know what I'm saying? A lot of people like, I didn't know this and that, and I'm like, that dude, he been doing that though. P is just not somebody that has to announce and, you know, have a parade and make a big deal about every little thing that he does. He makes his moves. You know, we got some quote unquote celebrities that anytime they do anything, especially something that might help some people, oh, they got to make a big deal about it and hold press conferences. Now, you know, P ain't done that. He been behind the scenes making big moves, helping people out and, and doing for people for a long time. You know, P been putting out records since, Lord, I believe, what, 99 Ways to Die, Ghetto Trying to Kill Me. That was late 80s. If I ain't if I ain't wrong, I believe that was late 80s. Maybe right up into the early, early 90s. But, you know, of course, we know most of it started with, with Ghetto Dope. And then from there, Ice Cream Man, that was, what, 94, 95? So, yeah, you know, P been doing it. And shouts out to him for being a good dude. Y'all know me. Y'all know I like good people. And I like people that do and try to help and try to be a good person and he is definitely he has definitely done that and he's still making moves go get your bag of rap snacks cuz <laughs> uh, that boy he gonna have a grocery store for us all over with and that's alright so anyway like subscribe you know what it is man keep it real live righteous